Vermonters have been using face masks well to protect people around them throughout the COVID-19 pandemic. Research shows that we can improve how we use masks to protect ourselves and others. The main reason we've been wearing face masks is to prevent the virus from reaching someone else. This is important because some people don't have symptoms and could spread COVID-19 without knowing it. We now know that good face masks might also prevent the person wearing the mask from getting infected by someone else. We also know that some face masks work well while others poorly. A disposable medical procedure mask is a reliable option, especially when the nose wires are used to form fit across the bridge of the nose. Many people have made or purchased tight-fitting, multi-layered cloth face masks that they can wash between uses. But make sure your single layer face mask doesn't look like this gator. And avoid any masks that do not fit closely to your face or cover your nose and mouth all the time. Recent studies have shown masks can be even more protective when they are tight fitting or when you wear more than one. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reported that experiments with these masks not only prevented the simulated wearer from spreading infection, but also protected the simulated wearer from infection by other people too. What was found to work best in these experiments was one, wearing a tight fitting face mask over a medical procedure mask. Two, knotting and tucking the loose edges of a medical procedure mask. And three, using a mask fitter that goes over a mask to draw all the edges of the mask tight to the face. Even wearing the neck gaiter can improve fit for someone wearing a medical procedure mask. Remember, the CDC experiments are done in ideal conditions, and only a few medical procedure masks and face coverings were tested. Do you need to wear a mask after two doses of the vaccine? The CDC says yes, as they learn more about how COVID-19 vaccines work in real world conditions. We don't know yet whether getting a COVID-19 vaccine will prevent you from spreading the virus that causes COVID-19 to other people, even if you don't get sick yourself. The CDC will continue to update this guidance as they learn more. Still, the studies show that these techniques can better limit the spread of the virus that causes COVID-19 to other people, and it might protect you better from infection as well.